What's up, guys? This is Mark from Top Loadum Cards. The Dodgers has have lost uh, Game Four. They are now down three to one. Face elimination up three more times. It's gonna be hard, but uh, I think they can do it. Will they do it? I don't know. So um, as you as if you guys saw watch the game, Arias absolutely got hammered i mean if you think about it like he got beat on three solo home runs uh, i think they're really aggressive and they know him a lot so they were basically hunting the fastball and in in the, some of those counts he it was kind of predictable that he was going to throw it but he just didn't look sharp no movement on the two seam uh, the slurve was okay, but not not sharp, not a lot of breaking. So, unfortunately, yeah, he gave up uh, some runs early, and the Dodgers couldn't score enough. So we're gonna open up this uh, Prism Mega Box, kind of serve two purposes. One, maybe. Uh, Cure some of the blues. Two, some good luck for tomorrow. Hopefully they can extend the series. There we go. There's the packs. So this is my last uh, mega box. I don't know if I'll buy any more. Uh, they're like okay, but for fifty dollars, I don't know. It seems like, I mean, you could get. Two and a half blasters of almost anything except for tops chrome but i don't know but yeah if you watch the game uh, you saw justin turner uh looks like it pulled hamstring i don't know they haven't really i think that he has to get evaluated again i mean it could be a blessing in disguise you never want to see anybody get hurt especially jt but i mean he's having um He's uh, having a bad series. The last two series, he has not hit. And um, yeah, he just, something doesn't look right. Like, I don't know if it's his neck slash shoulder or maybe it was his um, hamstring, the same thing that came up last year, but he looked good this year. So I don't think it's that. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I like Turner. He's one of my favorite players, but I mean, in this playoff run, you, you basically just got to go with whoever's producing. I mean, that's nice that you did something last year or you normally do this or that. But if you're not doing it now, you guys, they basically have to weigh his production against winning. So, I don't know. So, we're going to open up some of these. Joe Adele, nice. We have a green number 93 out of 125 Corbin Burns that's nice Tim Anderson number ink so we got a Joe Adele and we got a green right off the bat it's a good sign for the cards I don't know for the Dodgers tomorrow so I don't know uh, I I'm I'm guessing they're gonna go with uh, Chris Taylor at third they're probably gonna have AJ Pollock I think what they should do is they should have uh see this is where they miss like Edwin Rios like he, if not he would have been playing third and then you could have had Chris Taylor I think you should put Mookie in center and then Chris Taylor and right and AJ Pollock in left but I mean I don't know I don't know who's available now and um yeah I would drop Trey Turner down to like the number nine spot because I mean, he's just he's just a hole in the lineup, and he's not producing. Uh, maybe at the bottom, he sees less um, less quality pitches or something. I don't know. But now nowadays, it's in the playoffs, so I think every pitcher knows you're gonna get a quality at bat. So I don't know. Just um, yeah, I don't I don't know. He he can't he can't draw a walk. And he's just not getting on base, so. So I think this one is the. Let's look. 
I think this is like the lime green. So no odds, but that's what it is, lime green. So that's how this one is different from this one. I think this is regular green. This is the lime. Slight difference. I don't know, maybe you can see it on the camera. But there's a difference. So that's why this one's numbered. Yeah, and I think they just have to put up their put out their best lineup and just see what happens. I mean, I mean this is if they lose, they're done. So why not try to just go out there and put out the best lineup period and i mean gavin looks he had a he'll have a more opportunities next year but for right now like you just got to extend the series try to pick up some wins so yeah but uh i mean the dodger pitching i think they've just been overtaxed if you think about it they're down uh, three starters no kershaw no Dustin May, no Trevor Bauer. And uh, yeah, I think they're just overtaxed and just getting to the point where they have nothing left. Looks like we have an auto. Justin Dunn. That's a nice one. Here's a Casey Mize rookie class. So we've been getting quite a few autos the past uh, couple weeks. So just off the top, let's see. Pulled this one in the prism both the key brian hayes in the uh tops fire so we're getting quite a few autos it's a good thing And um, yeah, I don't know. They're going to have to make some tough decisions on payroll and um, how to move money around. So I think this is Prism, yeah. So Silver Sluggers. Or it's Ice Sluggers. It's a Prism. Yeah, they're just going to have to... I mean, I think in reality, they can afford to bite the bullet and they can kind of negotiate with some of the guys say like hey like if you take less money we'll basically run the team back as is and try to win it again and then some of the other guys they'll just pay the luxury tax i mean they can afford it that's a nice one jason dominguez emergent he might be coming up uh, next year we'll have to watch and see but yeah like i think they have a lot of tough choices to make so no, most notably, Max Scherzer, uh, Clayton Kershaw, Corey Seager, I think uh, Chris Taylor, and I believe like Albert Pujols and maybe one other person. They have uh, some contract. Randy Rosarena, Jazz Chisholm, Michael Brantley, Mark McGuire, Green. Looks like, uh, I mean, the Astros might be going back to the World Series. I hope not. But, um, I mean, it would be nice if the Dodgers were able to get there. Because, I mean, either one. If we won, like, we would take either one. We would take the Red Sox or we would take the Astros. Because we lost to both of them the last couple of years. But just, um, yeah. It looks very like a long shot, but um, I mean, you never know. Last year, I remember going. So this is last year when the pandemic happened. Uh, if you wanted to watch the game, because they were in the bubble um, at Dodger Stadium, they put up like these huge screens. I think they were like three stories and you could basically go there it's like a drive-in movie, drive movie theater. You could stay in your car, watch the game. And I did that for two of the games. And it was freaking awesome. Jonathan India. Rookie card. Everybody's looking for this one. And, you know, last year, they were tough, hard-fought games. This is a nice one. Sandy Koufax. Dylan Carlson. Prism. Silver. That's a nice one also. 
So that was, is that tier two? Yeah, tier two. That's a good one. And yeah, last year it just, I mean, it was, you never felt like they were totally out of it. This year it feels a little different, but I mean, they did it last year and I don't know. You never know. I mean, that's why they got to play these games. I mean, we do miss uh, Clayton Kershaw. We do miss um, Max Muncy. So hopefully, you know, a lot of people are going to come together and say, like, you know, I want to run it back. I want to see if we can really win it as is as constructed. So we'll see. Jeff Bag Bagwell. Francisco Lindor fireworks. But I'm not giving up on this year yet. I think they just need to do a better job of basically reconstructing the lineup so that you have the guys that are hitting. I think they need to they need to move Trey Turner down to like the the nine or the seven spot. He, I think Bellinger needs to move up. And I think you really need to produce like the top of the lineup. So I think Mookie Betts, Corey Seager, uh, Cody, and um, Chris Taylor, those have to be your top four hitters right off the bat. Because you got to apply maximum pressure. You got to make sure they're getting, they're the ones getting the most at bats because they're producing all the hits. And you just got to put out, put everybody out there, make everybody available, play, play the game and try to win. So these are like, this is the bonus pack. This is like the Carolina blues and the pinks. So you see there's like a lot of rookie cards. That's nice. So Andrew Vaughn, Debbie Garcia. There's a Trent Grisham, Kyle Lewis, Santiago Espinal, Taylor Trammell, Sixto Sanchez, Jose Berrios, Pudge, Bregman, Wyatt Matheson, and Christian Pache. Christian Pache is in the in the lineup or um, on the playoff roster. Uh, he pinch pinch ran the other day, but uh, did did not play. Um, I don't think he's gonna be coming up. I mean, right now, like let's say you have Rosario, you have Duvall, and you have Jock Peterson. He's not starting in front of any of those three. So I don't know. He might be like a, like a reserve player next year, or he might be one of those like um, I I think he can only play in the outfield. I don't know if he ever played infield, but yeah, he's gonna be like a utility player next year. So yeah, hopefully tomorrow's game is better. I think you're gonna see the Dodgers empty the bench. I think you're gonna see. I mean, because their backs are up against the wall. You're gonna see right at the beginning. I think. Uh, you're gonna see everybody pitch tomorrow. I think it basically they're gonna they're gonna look at the they're gonna tonight they're gonna study every scenario that's possible, and they're gonna look they're gonna look to see can Alex Vesia go two innings, you know can can uh, Brol pitch two innings can um, you know Canable pitch two innings can can we get to uh, Trinan and um, you know are they gonna go to Scherzer at the end I, I don't know like I I mean they they obviously they want to try to keep somebody for the next game but it's not guaranteed so we'll see what happens I mean that's the exciting thing that you'll see maybe somebody that's not used to a certain position be put in there and they're forced to perform and either they perform or they don't so yeah it's a uh, playoff baseball it's exciting but um, yeah, hopefully the Dodgers are able to win tomorrow. You just got to take it one game at a time and just play, play, play. But um, yeah, thanks for watching. Um, don't forget to enter all the giveaways. I have another giveaway coming up tomorrow. That one is Pokemon. And um, yeah, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching. And um, catch you guys next time.